one of the useful option of the method is hyphen w so hyphen w is follow which means it will wait for the new messages so it's like uh, tail tail command tail hyphen f which will follow similarly the d message hyphen f w is for follow so how is this useful so till now what we used to do we load the module and then we used to run a d message command and then we remove the module and then we used to run the d message command but with hyphen w option it is very easy you can run the d message hyphen w in background so d message hyphen w in background i am running this in background now i have this in background now let's load our old module like i say make it's already built i'm loading this module now so we already have some same similar module present so you can see the exit function it printed on the screen so we no need of typing the message again because the message is already running in background and it is running in follow mode now yeah you can observe here a very useful option of d message which is hyphen w you can whenever you're working with uh, debugging when, whenever you're working with writing kernel drivers you can keep d message hyphen w in background and you can observe the logs coming up